Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For everyone that is new, my name is C. So if you're just tuning in for the first time, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you guys can notify whenever I post a new video. For those that are returning subscribers, thank you for tuning in. So today I have a Shop Miss A haul. Um, I went on the website and I saw some little knickknacks and little things that I would love to have. So I wanted to share it with you guys in this video. So I'm not going to talk too much. So let's get into this video. And here's everything that I purchased. I'm not sure if this is their um, new packaging, but I love it. Okay, so getting into... So pretty much I got everything laid out on my table. So first things first is this pill bottle. I mean, it's not even a pill bottle. It's a pill container. Um... I got this because I wanted to be a little more organized when it comes to my taking my pills, taking my vitamins on time. So, so I ended up getting the pink one. They had two colors. And what I do like about this is it has the big open space here. And then if you lift it up, you have the different, um, different little holders pill holders so which is good so depending on what type of pills this can be for every day or you could just have one for one of the days of the week unfortunately it's only six holders but again this is a nice little pick-me-up and it's good for your purse you know when you're on the go so that's why i like this and it's very sleek it's very stylish so yay for this Next, I got the stainless steel mixing palette. This is a two-piece set. They do have it where you can purchase it separate, but of course, I wanted both. So when it comes, so I don't have to keep always putting the foundation. As you can see, I have foundation on my hand, but so I don't always have to put the makeup on the back of my hand. This is a nice little tray to use or if you need to mix colors put your concealer this is a great pick me up and it also come again with the spatula which is good and i like that if you rinse this off or clean this off you can just put it back in here and you will always keep your stuff together and it has a little button on the back where you can help secure it so i definitely love this again everything as everyone knows shamas a is super duper duper affordable so i didn't spend much for all of this stuff but let's keep it going so i did get these hair clips and these are the no crease hair clips And I like this, so whenever I'm doing my hair or I've done my hair and it's time to do makeup, I can help keep my hair out of the way. And also, you know, if you leave the clips on too long, you do get that creasing. So these are perfect. This was a great little pick-me-up as well. So next, I bought this mascara guard. So a lot of times when it comes to either me putting on um, mascara on the top or bottom sometimes it does get on my under eye or sometimes it do touch my eyeshadow so I wanted to get something that I can definitely use to help me not make those mistakes so I can't wait to try this and again it has it for the upper and lower lash so I believe this side is for the lower lash which I wish I would have just um, not did my under eye and waited to do it for this video so I could use this. And again, they have it for the top. So this is very cute, very sleek. And then it also comes with a eyelash comb. So if it gets clumpy or anything... You can definitely comb it out and help separate the lashes. 
So I did buy this brush cleaner. This is the Rose Scented Antibacteria Spray. So I like how it's definitely on the go. So for those traveling MUAs or MUEs, this would be perfect to add to your kit. Again, very affordable. Um, and it does have the rose um, scent. So I do love this. So I'm definitely going to try this out when it comes to using my brushes. Well, cleaning my brushes. So I can't wait to use this. Next, I got another hand mirror. And it has the AOA. This is um, part of the animal collection. So I love this hand mirror. I had the little one that had like the Mickey Mouse stickers that I put on there. So I, I tossed that one because I wanted to get a new one. So this is the mirror. And I love the print on the back. This is just a perfect, just perfect hand mirror. And I also do already have a mirror on my stand, but sometimes I don't want to hold this. So it's good to always have a variety of mirrors, um, as you can tell. So this is great. So I did get this bright eye eye massager wand. So pretty much, um, I'm starting to get really big on skincare, um, especially because I do wear makeup. So the best you, thing you can do, especially for people that wear makeup, is to take care of your skin. So I thought this was a, a good plus to add to my skincare um, regimen. And guys, I will be doing a updated um, skincare um, video coming soon. So definitely stay tuned for that. But this is what it looks like up close. And I love the handle because it definitely um, <clears throat> it definitely gives you a good grip and to have control over the product and over this. And I like how it has their little logo symbol here. Not logo symbol, but I like how it has the brand name on there as well. So you will use this um, after you apply your eye cream. And it says it helps de-puff eyes and prevent wrinkles. So I definitely can't wait to use this. So I also got their wedge sponges. And they come four in a pack. So I bought two packs, so I got a total of eight. So I really can't wait to use this. I mean, I've used wedges before, but I guess it's just, I don't know. I just wanted to get these, so. <laughs> and um, of course they're small, but they get super big when you um, wet them. So again, I can't wait to use these and see how good it does on my makeup applications. So next, I got two of their brow pencil. One is in brow pencils. One is in brown and the other is in ebony. So I didn't know which one to get. So I just got went ahead and got both of them. So I definitely will do a eyebrow tutorial using these. I definitely um, need to do an updated brow tutorial. So again, stay tuned for that. I got a couple ideas under my belt that I want to bring to my channel so again stay tuned um next i got their eyeshadow palette this is i want to do i have a name so the palette doesn't have a specific name but this is one of the nude palettes again i love nude um eyeshadow i do color from time to time but i definitely just like just like your everyday makeup looks. So this is a nice brown palette. Nice warm earthy tone color. So again, stay tuned for the video because I definitely want to try these out as well. And also, 
I got their concealer. So, so I didn't know. Well, I got this one, of course. This is going to be for um, my contour. But as far as the concealer, I got it in soft tan, and I'm hoping this. I'm hoping this is my shade, but they all look the same. Um, I do have their foundation that I bought a while ago that I still have not used. Um, and I bought two shades because, again, I didn't know, you know, online sometimes the pictures just look different. So, we're going to try this out. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to probably just do a, a makeup look just trying out these products. Again, I still have not used these. So... Not sure how it's going to look, but I did get the shade and foundation in the Honey Beige and in Amber. So lastly, I got two of their brushes. Um, one is an angle contour brush and the other is a V contour brush. Um, I still haven't found the perfect contour brush that I really, really am in love with. Now, I will say the brush I use from the e.l.f. Oval Collection, I'm definitely in love with that. Um, I, def I did a video on the e.l.f. brushes, so I will link that in the description box below so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But I definitely like how the foundation, I mean, I like how the contour, the brush I use for the contour looked. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Kyla, Kayla, Kyla, C-A-L-A. -A, this is their brush. <coughs> and I like that it's, it's still fluffy, but it's kind of dense as well. Again, this is what it looks like. And then the other brush... Also, a kind of fluffy, dense um, contour brush, but it's more flat. Where this is, it has the dips on both sides, if you can see, or it's like an angle. And this is more of a flat. Like, I can also see me kind of using this as a foundation brush as well this second brush this is more of the flat so guys those are all the different products that i did get from shop miss a again these are just some little knickknacks just to add to what i already have and some things that i did want to try so definitely stay tuned for an upcoming video for that um i really can't wait to try the concealer um i did watch a few um youtube videos but I tried that the girl that kind of looked my complexion. I tried to go with what she had, the 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 products that she had as far as the concealer. But we're just gonna see. So it's just gonna be either it's gonna be a good one or it's gonna be a bad one. But you know, ain't nothing wrong with trial and error. This is makeup, so we all. Sometimes you get a good product, sometimes you don't. But again, guys, thank you for tuning in. I hope some of these products are something that you will want to pick up. Or if you already have it, definitely let me know in the description box below. Again. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you guys can notify whenever I post a new video. Thank you guys. Bye.